Welcome back in. Robin Freilich knew she was taking over a rebuilding situation with the Bowling Green women's basketball team. But in year three, she's got the Falcons sitting at 3-0 as they begin conference play tonight. Falcons welcoming in Eastern Michigan to the Stroh. BG hasn't started 4-0 since 2013. BG was down early, but staying in it. Get it over to Lexi Fleming. She goes behind the back. Sweet little bucket there. BG with some early momentum. Later, Falcons getting it done on the defensive end. Katie Hempfling comes up with a loose ball up ahead to Fleming. She would finish it off with a layup. Falcons starting to take over, and then Kenzie Lewis finds Fleming again all alone on the wing. Rattles in a jumper. She had a game high 21. She's just a freshman. Falcons win at 71-64. It's a great start, and we know that that is what it is. It's a start, um, but it's where everyone wants to be after their first MAC game. I think um, finding ways to win is really um, that's a, infusing confidence into our team. So, it, you know, it's interesting. We typically don't play a mat game this early, but this season obviously is, is different in so many ways. So I'm um, really proud. Eastern Michigan's a very good team. All uh, th Those kids have played a lot of minutes in the MAC and had a lot of success. And um, really proud of us for, for gutting it out and finding a way. And how about a men's and women's double header, double header a little further south? Tiffin University taking on the University of Finley today. Start with the men. Oilers working it on offense. Tremaine Gray flushes it home with two hands. Dragons now with the answer. Tanner Johnson from the wing buries a three. He had nine points, but it would be Finley that was too much in this one. The great pass down low to Nathan Bruns. He lays it in. Game high 22 for him. Oilers beat Tiffin 89 to 74. And the Tiffin and Finley women also in action today. Dragons working it on offense. Great find inside to Jensen Heigl, who lays it in for two. Later, Oilers working it now. Down low to Bridget Landon. She muscles it up and in. Finley leading. Tiffin with an answer, though. Jessica Chase in the corner knocks down a triple. But the Oilers just too much down the stretch. Bridget Landon with the and one. Finley wins it 81 to 75. All right, that is going to do it for us. Remember, if you missed any of the highlights, just head over to our WTOL YouTube page. Thanks to everyone out here at Elmwood for hosting us tonight. You have been gracious hosts, and we appreciate it. And thank you for watching. Charlie Zodge, Chrysler Jeep Ram, Big Board Friday. We'll see you back here next week.